Hello all, welcome to Techno channel. This video is about key generation transform in SAP BODS. Please subscribe to this channel if you are not yet subscribed and click the bell icon to get notifications. What is key generation transform? Key generation transform will generate the unique key columns based on the unique ID we assign. Key generation transform looks up the maximum existing key value from a table and uses it as the starting value to generate new keys. So the subsequent key value should be generated based on the existing maximum key value. This is the key generation transform editor. In schema in we have the source table which is customer table. Schema out is the output after key generation. If you see here the table name section we will give the source table as the table name. We will give the generated key column here. Based on that key column it will generate the unique key values. We can give the increment value here, so we are giving 1 as the increment value here. You see here, this is the key generation transform we can see in the BODS system. This is the source data and this is the target data after generating key column. We generated the key column for the salary field. So if you see the salary field, the maximum value of salary field is 40,000 here. Key generator will generate the key values by taking base as the maximum value of the source data. So here it will start it as 40,001, we gave the increment value as 1, so 40,001, 40,002, 40,003 and 40,004 so on. Like this we can generate the key values from the key generation transform. Let's see how to implement key generation transform in the BODS designer. This is the source table we have, let's, let's generate the key values for the data in this table. So key generation transform will be available in the data integrator. So in data integrator, this is the key generation transform. So drag and drop it here. So mapping the source table with the key generation transform. If you open the key generation transform, this is how it will look like. Here I am giving the table name. So here I give source table as the table name. Let's generate key columns for the batch field here. I am keeping increment value as 1. Here the unique batch number will start from the maximum batch number in the source data plus 1. Suppose 1000 is the maximum batch number in the source data. It will take the 1001 starting unique value in the target table. The main thing here is if you want to generate unique key value using key generation transform, we need to assign unique ID here. Based on that unique ID, it will generate the key columns. So go back and map the key generation transform to the target table. Mapping key generation transform to the target table so that in target table, it will generate the key columns for the batch field. This is the way we can generate the key values using key generation transform. If you have any doubts, please comment it in the comment section. Thanks for watching and please subscribe if you are not subscribed.